again, human beings from the planet Earth. I uh, was just going through my email and I was given some information and asked to share it immediately. Uh, as of now, that person will remain anonymous because of the sensitivity of the information until the point where I get confirmation, but I wasn't going to wait to put the information out. I'm um, going to go now to the PDF and read to you in case the screen recorder sucks, which I am sure it does. RFID chips and forced immunizations, 5-2-2012. This information uh, that is just presented to me, and I feel it is my duty as an American citizen to pass this information along to you. I have heard personal testimony from soldiers involved in roadblock exercises out in areas of the United States, west, southwestern states like California, Nevada, Arizona. I do not know where else these drills are being held or what kind of timeline is on this agenda. What I have been told by reputable sources is that law enforcement along with military personnel have been participating in roadside immunization roadblocks where you are given the opportunity to obey and accept the inoculation or to be put on a bus and taken to an undisclosed location. At these roadblocks, the officials have RFID detectors to basically scan you to determine if you already have the immunization. These immunizations apparently contain a tiny, almost invisible RFID chip that is injected into the body along with the immunization. This is what they are using the detectors for, to see who has the chip and who does not. Having worked in the microelectronics industry and also having worked with RFID technology in the past, I can tell you that such a device could control every aspect of your life. Your RFID can be tied to almost anything, your bank account, your medical or criminal records, anything that you uh, about you that is in a computer database. It can also be used to track you the same way the technology is currently used to track shipments and packages. This is no joke and some images of the technology are shown below. The first image of the detector and the second image of the RFID chip itself. Now I can tell you a little bit about the person that sent this to me in the fact that he is very trustworthy, a fellow truth seeker, and doesn't lead his life based on hype propaganda or anything else. He works very hard to inform people about things that he knows about, works very hard and he's willing to also uh, trade his skills um, to other people, something I encourage, barter, um, outstanding human being. I, I trust this. If he took the time to forward this information, he himself knows that it's from a credible source. Uh, refusal to accept these immunizations can result reportedly in fines or detainment, or maybe they uh, will simply turn you off so that you cannot purchase goods or receive medical treatment. Who really knows? The problem reaction solution method that the elite use to convince the masses to demand se such technology is working very well for them. That is, at least for those people who deny these facts to themselves who have not yet awoken. Uh, for those of us who have already awake to what is going on, we are not being fooled. I hope this turns out to be completely false, and I will then be happy to be scorned and laughed at. That would be a huge sigh of relief. However, if it is true, then my suggestion to you all would be to take a firm stand against such practice and to become as self-dependent as possible, a concerned citizen. So, anyway, there you have it. Um, you know, and this is the thing. Uh, I trust the person relaying the information. They wouldn't give me bad information. They wouldn't waste my time. They wouldn't waste their own time. Um, and we have heard talk about this all over the place. So, let's get us some more live reports. People are traveling through those areas. Share the information. People traveling through those areas report back. Um, anybody that can send me a uh, live video of this going on, that would be awesome. I will get it out immediately. Um, all my personal contact information is on my website, front page, masterofmanythings.com, my phone number, my Skype, my email. Reach out to me. We need to know for sure if this is going on, and, and it's the summertime. We're all traveling in those areas. Uh, much love. Be safe. Hold them accountable, and... Uh, don't let them do this. It's unnecessary. It is unnecessary. It's time to uh, kill the machine.